Did you know some pieces can be activated with the black light? Well, let's take a look here and see what we have, and welcome. So I have a portion of my Lego Bricks and Pieces collection, and I want to sort out the pieces that are activated with the black light versus regular bricks. So as you can see, I have studs and flame pieces, bricks, round bricks and tiles and such. Now you can't really tell with using a regular bulb. These look almost the same to me. So which one of these can be activated with the black light, we don't know. Now some like this, you can tell they kind of have like a fluorescent color. But that's still not good enough. So I have a very low powered black light. This is like a camping light that I've had for a while, but I replaced it with a black light fluorescent tube. I don't think they make these anymore. You can also use LEDs or incandescent black lights. So basically you would just take this and you'd wand this over and you see which pieces are activated. As you can tell, you can see some are glowing. But we got to turn off the big light to find out, so let's see what it looks like. So as you can see, I got some pretty nice pieces in here. I got these column pieces that are glow. I also got some blue. What else do we got in here? Obviously the orange doesn't really glow that bright. So this is how they do those light shows at the brick conventions. See that looks like it's glowing right in my hand. And as you can see, i got some tiles like these. I mean, that's bright. <laughs> and these also here as well. They glow in the dark. Well, glow with the black light. Here's a round one by one brick. I mean, that's pretty bright. And i got some studs like the... Well, the first, let's look at the flame pieces. I mean, that looks like that's really hot. <laughs> See if I can get that close for you to see. This is not the most powerful light, it only puts out a few watts. So we got some fluorescent yellow studs. Now it looks like we don't have any red, purple, or pink that are reflective. This one may almost looks like it's trying to. Here we got some nose cones. It's like a lot of the orange and yellow ones are reflective. Pretty cool. No uh, blue or white. Here's some of these gems. It's like I see the yellows and the greens glowing. So what I'm trying to do is I want to sort all these pieces out. I may want to end up in the future building a, a nice little light show theme. And you know this is pretty cool. Take the light away. You can't really tell. So, if I'm going through all this, I'm going to have to end up going through all this by hand. So I can just wave this over. I need to find something more permanent. This is just a battery powered light. It takes like four AA batteries. So yeah, you can just see all the stuff that glows in the dark. Pretty cool. It's not really much of a tutorial, but just to kind of show you guys and gals that if you get yourself a black light, be amazed at what other pieces that will glow in the dark. And it does also work with coral. So if you've got any bricks that are coral, look at that. So they don't even have to be transparent. And those are coral tiles. And they act like pretty nice with the black light. I'll show you. See? Just standard coral tiles. So these do work well with a black light, so if you're using these for a, like an underwater theme, they work really well. So this is a bit of just a rough video. So if you have a black light or you want to get one, to see what bricks are activated with the black light, this is a good way to tell.